Hey everyone, Turtle Power 2 here, and in this video, I will be doing a review on the 7 inch Berserker Predator. This is a line by the toy company named Leonard. So, in 20, 2018, they made Rampage movie toys, uh, which, if you try to buy them now, are a pretty penny to buy. Now, I, I'm just gonna say I give this figure 10 out of 10, same thing for the entire wave. This is probably my favorite Predator in the wave um so far this is from predators the 2018 film uh so a reason that i know that this is definitely six inches is because i mean seven inches is because this is a marvel legends symbiote um marvel legends and you can definitely tell that is an inch taller the predator figure um, I think it's very good. So I'm going to move on to the packaging now. Move this guy aside. So, um, a smart disc is not included. The plasma bazooka is included. That's what this is. It's in silver paint, which is awesome. And the comb stick is not. So I don't know why there's like, I don't know. And the, the electro claw, I don't know why there's three things missing. You don't have to attach the wrist blades, and I'm and I'm really upset that they don't go in and out. Um, and then here is a story on the Predator. So if you want to pause that, just do that right now. Okay. So this guy has 25 points of articulation, which I feel like is awesome. Then it shows the Predator collection. These are all the Predators you can get in this wave. Uh, I think they're releasing such a small amount, like three figures, is so everyone is able to get their hands on them, which I like a lot because, like, um, I think that's a good idea. So this is what the packaging looks like. It says Berserker, Predators. Like, it'll say the name of the Predator and then what movie it's from. So Berserker is from the movie Predators, 25 points of articulation. The Leonard logo, the Predator logo and i i love the way that the figure looks with this uh jaw right here i think that makes it look so much cooler and of course these are walmart exclusives you can only buy these at walmart or ebay but i would recommend just buying them from walmart then it says predator collection that's what the bottom of it looks like predator collection the top of the packaging sorry for that glare so I only have two so far, like in my last review. Uh, so uh, he has paint, uh, like this uh, brownish metallic paint. And then, what does it say right there? Uh, and then it says a bunch of information on the bottom. Uh, so th there's like a ball joint in the torso. Same thing for the last one, which I like a lot. That's super cool. It can go 360, and um, as for the head, the head can move, and I like that a lot, a pretty good amount, and I absolutely love the way that they made the jaw look. I feel like the helmet is just so cool. Here's a side view, a back view, side view, bottom view, top view, and you can kind of see some of the head, so I like it that they did that. And as for the uh, plasma cannon, I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right. Um, it can actually move a lot, and that's what I like about it. Like, you can do some role play or something, and I, I love how they made it move on that ball joint. It's super cool. Like, that is really awesome. And I love the detail that they put on this guy. Um, he's not missing any detail unlike the last Predator, the City Hunter Predator. This one does not have any fishnets, so it's not missing any detail. The only thing I think I kind of don't like is the, uh, green or how light it is. So this is what the back looks like. This is unpainted. That's supposed to be painted right there. Um, and this is kind of made of like a soft plastic. Uh, like I said, the dreads are made out of a soft plastic too but these ones are soft and thin and like on the feet there's a ball joint which i think is super cool uh the arms can move up and down the sh the shoulders can move up and down um and this is what the blade looks like the 
wrist blade but um it's just one and it can't retract which is disappointing but it is made of a pretty hard plastic the hands can move so when they say this guy has 25 points of articulation they're not playing around um and then what you can do is you can put this on there and it's kind of hard to do it i'm gonna try to remove it but It's a little bit of a challenge. So this is what the plasma plasma bazooka on uh, the Berserker Predator looks like. It's really oversized, and I'm pretty sure this never appeared in the film once. They just use regular uh, plasma cannons. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, so it's made out of a silver, but it feels like, you can definitely, it definitely feels like paint. Um, I know it is, but it, I don't usually get that kind of feel from other toy companies. But yeah, I think they've been doing a great job, and them getting the Alien and Predator license is a really cool thing to say. So the only accessory does that is included is the Plasma Bazooka, which I really do wish it came with more stuff like more accessories the reason i think that they didn't do that was because they uh they would have had to up the price for retailers and they didn't want to do that like i'm pretty sure they would have had to price these at like 20 17 dollars and a person's gonna buy a 12 dollar figure any day or like an uh over a 17 or 20 dollar figure so yeah, um, that is my review on the Berserker Predator 7 inches. I give it a 10 out of 10. I think it's a very cool Predator toy. I do recommend, so please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video.